Welcome to Relationship Tips with Akin Anyonwale. I'm your host on this broadcast. You can watch previous episodes online and on all our social platforms as is being displayed on the screen right now. This week's episode promises to be very, very interesting. And we've been looking at marriage relationships and we have talked about, in previous episodes, we've talked about uh, the purpose of marriage, which is number one, the communication. We've looked at different types of communication that you can have. But this episode, on this episode, we want to take it a little bit further. The purpose, the second purpose of marriage. It's been said that when purpose is not known, abuse is inevitable. So you must know the purpose why you are in marriage relationship. The second purpose of marriage relationship is companionship. Genesis chapter 2 verse 18, God said, It is not good for man to be alone. He said, I will make an help meet for him, a companion for him. And under companionship, you will see that compatibility is number one. In marriage relationship, compatibility cannot be, or let me say, may not be 100% initially. But as the relationship grows, God expects you and your husband, you and your wife, to be more compatible together. There are basic um, compatibility that must exist between you and your husband. Then you build on it. You build on it. It's very, very important. It's a major problem that some marriages have today is because of companions. There is no compatibility. You see, the husband is going to the right, the wife is going to the left. When I got married, we had a few challenges with my wife. Being that I love sport, I love football, but my wife does not like football. I like football, watching football, what she does not like. All right? And we have one television. So when we want to watch, I want to watch football, she wants to watch another thing. It becomes a problem. Both of us are, are born again, we communicate well, but in the area of com- compatibility, we could not flow until I was able to shift to the left and she was able to shift to a little bit, then our compatibility began to get better, began to get better by the day. You must understand that you cannot always, you will not always have your way. The mar- in marriage, husband and wife are meant to shift a little bit. You are to shift to the right. The wife are supposed to shift to the left. You build on your companionship, and I'll be giving in subsequent episodes, I'll be giving you the various uh, characteristics of compatibility that you need to take note of that will help you to build your compatibility. God wants husband and wife to be together in purpose. Together. Compatibility, I mean, companionship means you are. You are happy to be in the company of your wife. You are happy to be in the company of your of your husband. You are always looking forward to it. You are looking forward to be in the company of your wife, in the company of your husband. I pray for you today, everyone here that in your marriage you are facing turbulent time. I decree upon you that by today the peace of God is coming upon that marriage in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever has been disturbing your marriage, whatever has been bringing ringing storm, the wind that has been blowing against your marriage today, the peace of God will reign in that marriage in the name of Jesus Christ. I will see you again some other time. God bless you. Always remember that relationship is everything. God bless you.